you are welcome to LFN What's Your Say. Clearly your number one listening show, where we discuss real issues with real people like you. We are still featuring our Kelly. Real name, Robert Sylvester Kelly. Also known as the R&B King. Let us appreciate the fact that our Kelly will not only emerge from the confines of prison with a mixture of gratitude for his newfound freedom, but also with the heavy burden of the many years wrongfully taken away from him. The world outside the Federal Correctional Institute's prison walls in Butner has changed in many ways he will scarcely fathom and yet despite the challenges that will definitely lay ahead, R. Kelly is determined to reclaim his life and rediscover the rhythm that have unfortunately been silenced for so long. We all can't fail to imagine that the first few months of R. Kelly's now emanate freedom will be a whirlwind of emotions, as the king of R&B reacquaints himself with a world that had moved on without him. The technological advancements, the shifts in societal norms and the evolving music landscape will be both fascinating and overwhelming. Despite the hurdles, R. Kelly will draw strength from his passion for music and the art form that had sustained him during the darkest days of his wrongful imprisonment. Reconnecting with his love and excellency in music, R. Kelly will for sure embark on a journey to rebuild his career. The music industry could have changed but his timeless talent transcends eras. For us the supporters who are already touched by his story of resilience and injustice, will as usual rally behind him transforming R. Kelly into a symbol of hope and perseverance. In the midst of his musical revival, R. Kelly will soon become an advocate for criminal justice reform. He will leverage his platform to raise awareness about wrongful convictions and the flaws in the legal system that had stolen precious years from him, and this will subsequently inspire lawmakers to reevaluate policies and work towards a more just society. However, R. Kelly's scars of imprisonment have already run deep and the adjustment to normal life will not come without its challenges, after grappling with the psychological toll of his wrongful conviction. He however, R. Kelly as we know him will turn his pain into advocacy and thus shedding light on the need for mental health services, especially for those re-entering society after years of unjust imprisonment. Amidst the legal struggles, R. Kelly has found solace in both his die-hard supporters, his legal team and also in the music that has always defined his identity. His albums which are infused with a poignant blend of nostalgia and renewal have become anthems of hope for those facing adversity, despite some people's calls to silence him. R. Kelly's life after prison is going to become a testament to the power of resilience, the ability of music to heal and the importance of fighting for justice. As he continues to compose the soundtrack of his own redemption, Robert Kelly will become a living embodiment of the indomitable spirit that can rise from the ashes of injustice, and thus inspiring others to find their own melodies of triumph in the face of adversity. In his personal life, I strongly believe that R. Kelly will be reconnected with family and friends who have remained steadfast throughout his incarceration. The relationships that endured the test of time will become his pillars of support as he readjusts to the rhythms of everyday life. Despite the lost years, R. Kelly will for sure cherish the moments of joy and laughter, cherishing the simple pleasures that had been denied to him for so long. R. Kelly's release from prison will be undeniably a momentous occasion that will spark a wave of celebration among his dedicated supporters, who have tirelessly advocated for his innocence and freedom. The news of his freedom will definitely spread like wildfire and as the truth keeps unfolding, relief and triumph ripples through the community that has stood by him throughout his difficult journey. As a point to note, there are more innocent people in our jails and prisons today than ever before. The rate of exonerations continues to rise revealing an unreliable system of criminal justice. A lack of accountability for police and prosecutors' reliance on junk science or mistaken eyewitnesses and the indigent defense crisis are major contributors to wrongful convictions that have undermined the credibility of our system and ruined the lives of innocent men and women. A conviction may be classified as wrongful when a person convicted is factually innocent of the charges or if there were procedural errors that violated the convicted person's rights. More than half of wrongful convictions can be traced to witnesses who lied in court or made false accusations. In 2018, a record number of exonerations involved misconduct by government officials. The strength of our criminal justice system depends on its accuracy and its ability to convict the guilty and to clear the innocent. But we know that wrongful convictions happen but identifying and understanding the causes is critical to maintaining the integrity of our justice system. No one can deny the fact that in the immediate aftermath of R. Kelly's release, 
his supporters will organize impromptu gatherings and probably rallies to express their delight. Streets will echo with cheers and the air will be filled with the jubilant sounds of his music, a fitting tribute to the star musician who has endured decades of injustice. We are sure that here in his hometown Chicago, a vibrant celebration will unfold creating a festive atmosphere that will spill into every corner of town. It is also very obvious that social media will become a platform for a virtual celebration with several related hashtags trending globally as supporters share messages of congratulations, anecdotes of their involvement in the advocacy efforts, expressions of gratitude for the tireless work of Jennifer Bonjean and her legal team, and activists who are relentlessly fighting for R. Kelly's freedom. In my personal view, I do believe that it would be a wonderful gesture to organize concerts and benefit events to commemorate R. Kelly's release, featuring performances by renowned artists who admired his resilience, talent and stood by him during his trying times. It would further be prudent for part of the proceeds from these events to go towards supporting organizations dedicated to criminal justice reform and exonerate assistance, aligning with R. Kelly's commitment to making a positive impact beyond his impending personal triumph. We all know R. Kelly is a very appreciative person who will definitely be very humbled by the outpouring of support and will take his freedom as an opportunity to personally connect with his supporters. I believe he will have urge to attend meet and greet sessions, sign autographs and express his gratitude for the unwavering belief in his innocence. R. Kelly's release from incarceration and subsequent release from the prison enclave will generally prompt significant reforms in the justice system. Lessons learned will include, though not limited to the need for improved evidence handling, increased scrutiny of forensic methods, reforms in interrogation practices, enhanced legal aid and defense resources, a focus on rehabilitation and re-entry programs, a review of wrongful conviction cases and a commitment to community engagement and transparency. These changes will aim at preventing future miscarriages of justice, protect the innocent and ensure a more equitable and accountable legal system. Appeal court argument. Let us as usual rally together in support and optimism. R. Kelly has demonstrated exceptional dedication and an unwavering commitment to justice. It is in times like these that our encouragement can make a significant impact. Our positive energy and support can be a source of inspiration, providing R. Kelly through attorney Bonjean with the confidence needed to present a compelling argument before the court. Let's stand united behind him, remaining optimistic about a favorable outcome. The journey ahead may seem to be challenging. But the combined strength of Bonjean's capabilities and the supportive community around R. Kelly ensures that we all face this endeavor with resilience and determination. As we eagerly await the outcome, let us remember that the power of collective optimism is a force that transcends challenges and can ultimately contribute to a positive outcome. We want R. Kelly free sooner than later. Thank for watching this video, a production of LFN Media giving you another perspective of issues at hand. We make it our business to keep you updated with the truth amidst the cloud of lies the media wants you to believe. It is therefore important that you subscribe to this channel, hit the bell icon and allow all notifications so that you don't miss out whenever we publish a new video.